Hey guys, it's the Obud Man here, back with another video, and today on Crash Bandicoot The Wrath of Cortex, we are going to fight the boss of the first, of this first hub area, of the Earth area. Well, well, looks like the Bandicoot's been busy collecting crystals. I warned you, Bandicoot. Finally, I get to wrap my fingers around your puny orange neck. Alright, so that last guy you just saw was basically Dr. Cortex's minion. It's basically a much stronger bandicoot. And for each boss fight, we're going to be fighting him. But he has a special power depending on each, uh, each elemental. So in this case, he is going to be helped by the Earth Elemental Mask. So there's him. And now he's in this rock, this rock ball. And we're in our little sphere thing, back from a couple parts ago. Alright, so the way we defeat him is, there's these two rocks that roll around the, the arena, and we have to change them to blue. And once we get both of them blue, then he loses some health. You gotta be careful, because if he hits one of your balls, then they turn back to normal. Or if he hits just a regular one that's not blue, it'll turn his color orange. Alright, so there we go, there's Aku Aku. Alright, so we got some health off him. Now for the second round, we got three balls. Also, we can't touch him, as you saw earlier, because then we'll lose health. Whoa. Alright, that was a little bit uncalled for. Oh, he got one of him or- he got one of the balls orange. Alright, there we go. Also, you can kind of see a map at the top right. Come on. Also, guys, I'm very close now to 100 subscribers. If you notice, I've been... There hasn't been a, very many videos on my channel recently. That's just because I've been working on the 100 subscriber special. Which I'm hoping will be done when I reach that point. No! No, I don't have that much health. I'm at 10%. I suck at this boss fight. Come on, one more left. Got him. Ah, oh, we still got one more to go. Alright, now we have... four balls. I wish there was a way to regain our health. Alright, there we go, that's one ball. Watch out if... Uh oh two balls, come on. Oh, he, he knocked one out. If I see... Okay, if I see Crunch, I'm just gonna run away. Like, right there. Alright, oh, one of them's orange now. Okay, there's three... No, that's still two! No, no, no! Oh, now he's got two orange. And I gotta wait for them. No, no. No! Three percent. No. Don't attack me. How do we get those balls back to normal? There. Come on. One. No, no, no. Two. Come on. Finish him. No. No. Come on. No. There it is. Oh, no. Sorry, you guys have to see this. It's taking so long. Come on. Come on, yes. 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 We got him. Alright, that is the end of the Earth Elemental. But Crunch is still alive. Uh, Alright, yeah, now we go to the center and we collect this token. Basically, after every boss, there's a power-up. So we just got the tiptoe power up, where we can walk over nitros. Alright, so now we're returning back and we can enter the next, uh... Alright, so we were done with that level. Cortex! When are you and that super weapon of yours going to put an end to that interfering bandicoot? You are beginning to test my patience! Uh, uh... I'm working on a Dukauka. 
Listen, Crash, you may have outsmarted Rocco, but there are three more elemental masks where he came from. And just as luck would have it, they are all significantly more powerful. Ha! I have no doubt that the water elemental, Wawa, will make sure you never see the light of day. Yeah, the water boy and I are gonna take you out. Ooh, I'm gonna rip you limb from limb. All right, so now we go on to the second, the second world, which is the water world. As you can tell, it's raining, and we got this water vapor over the boss level. All right, so level six, jungle rumble. Fresh Bandicoot, you've got some nerve setting foot into my domain without an invitation. Don't talk back to me. I'll fix that attitude problem of yours! Alright, so that was the new elemental mask we must face. The water elemental. Alright, so here is level 6 jungle rumble. It's fairly dark, so I don't want to miss any crates like I did in the last part. If you want to see where that crate was, by the way, I still haven't gotten the gem. But I pointed it out with a little annotation in the uh, previous Let's Play part. Alright, but anyways, let's focus on this level. Maybe I'll go back and show me getting that crate and getting the gem, I don't know. I probably will, because then I could just basically say, oh look, I beat the game, but I didn't get any of it on tape. See, I could do that with all items, basically, is what I'm trying to say. So I'm probably going to show me getting the gem from that level. I have nothing much to say for this level. Other than it's a uh, nice jungle theme, similar to uh, that other one with the ball. Bamboozled. Oh, there's a checkpoint. Oh, where was that? Was that crate? Oh, there's Aku Aku. Alright. Alright, there we go. Got the life. Wow, look how many lives we have. Can we go up? Oh, I thought we could go up there. Alright, let's jump. There we go. Is this one also... Oh, I think this one is. We have to flop on this one. There we go. That one too? Nope, that one's pure iron. Okay, let's move on. I don't see any crates that we might have missed. Oh wait, is that something? No. Alright, now here's the water. The shallow end is fine, but if we go in that deep area... No! Can we still get that? Awesome. Is this something over here? No. Okay. Just nitros. All right, that's a checkpoint. Oh, I know. I know. What we have to do now. Here's the bonus level. I forgot how long this actual level was. All right, so let's do this bonus. Got some nice TNT here. Over here. And over here. Oh, here we can use our sneak power up. 
we just hold L2 and we tiptoe across those nitros. And now we explode them all. I can't really see what's back there. All right, there we go. very careful. Alright, we got all of them. Wow, we got three lives there. Sweet. Alright, now we move on to the rest of the level where we get to ride this thing. I guess it's a jeep or something. And we gotta run away, or drive away from these rhinoceroses. And we failed there. Alright, so X is to boost up. I forgot how to do that. I think we can just let the rhinos get the crates, though. Oh, this is crazy. Okay. No! Alright. Back where we started. Oh, are we done? No, that's just a checkpoint. Ooh, good, th good thing we actually got those. Oh, we missed that one crate. I got the crate, guys. Don't worry. Alright. Just, just a bit longer. What did I just hit? good. Alright. Now, the big question is, did we get the gem? If we didn't, then that'd be extremely sad, but okay. I thought there was a, a little ditch there. My TV is so dark. Okay, we got the gem. And now we can return back. Alright guys, so that is pretty much it for this Let's Play part of Crash Bandicoot The Wrath of Cortex. Uh, I know I said I get one of these parts out every week, but it turned out I didn't even stick to that for one week. So, um, yeah, after my 100 subscriber special, my video should be running back to normal. And I'll be getting that gem in the next part, the other one we missed from the previous world. So I hope you guys enjoyed this Let's Play part of Crash Bandicoot The Wrath of Cortex. I hope you like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video.